Yo, what's up guys, it's PlayStation here, and today I'm finally bringing you back another video of a Lenovo gaming performance. Today I'm bringing you the Lenovo ThinkPad T420, which is a workstation, not a gaming PC. So, you wanted to see how it works and how it plays? Well, I got the results for you here today. The PC got a 4 core Intel Core i5 2520M CPU, which is a base clock of 2.5 GHz. It's installed with 6 GB of RAM and has an SSD of 128 GB. The GPU is an Intel HQ Graphics 3000, which is very, very bad. I don't know what to call it. A, H, a, a G, G driver? A graphics driver? No, it's not. I, I want to call it a, a GPU. I will call it a graphics driver. I don't fucking know. It's pretty shitty. Anyway, here's the results. Starting off playing Assassin's Creed 2 with a 720p, because I don't want any lower resolution than that. Uh, I turn all the graphics down to the lowest, and we got a minimum of 13 FPS, a maximum of 38 FPS and an average of 24 FPS, which is, if I used to have a better PC, it's playable, but I, I, I wouldn't do that, but it's playable for you guys if you want to play on a low FPS. I mean, if you're okay with playing low FPS. Moving on to the next game, Hitman Absolution. Uh, I, I, again, I turned the game to 720p and with the lowest graphic settings and we got a minimum of 12 FPS, a maximum of 32 and an average of 22. So again, in this game, uh, uh, it's less playable than Assassin's Creed 2, but it's also playable uh, because you're very sneaky, so um, it's playable. Head over to League of Legends, which is very playable. Uh, I turned the game, I played the game at the maximum uh, maximum resolution of the screen, which is 1600 by 900 at medium settings, and the game ran very fine with an average of 59 FPS. And the lowest we went was at 35, and the maximum max was well, was actually going up to 79, which is pretty good uh, with medium settings. League is very well made to like laptops and shit. Moving over to Minecraft, I know there's a lot of Minecraft fans playing with laptops. Uh, we got a minimum, minimum of 2 FPS, a maximum of 104 and an average of 35. Uh, where we play with medium to low settings at 1600 by 900 because you can't lower the resolution of Minecraft. I uh, have to lower the resolution of the whole screen. Uh, uh, I don't know, I don't want to do that. And, um, to mine for Minecraft 35 FPS, I was very disappointed. Yeah, I don't think that's much playable. I'm very disappointed. Moving on to the Rise of the Tomb Raider, didn't work. Moving on to Rust, we got a minimum of zero FPS, maximum of 14, and, uh, and an average of eight. Basically, this game is totally unplayable. I played it at the potato settings, as they call it, and at 720p, and it was completely useless. Moving over to simple planes, we got an average of 34 FPS with medium settings at 720p. Again, very disappointing, and um, but sometimes the FPS got up like the maximum was 455, but it also dropped sometimes to like the lower 24s. So this game, I was very disappointed. I had to play it at 720p, and I don't know. This PC is very weird coming to gaming performance. So, if you want to game on the computer, I'm not really recommending it. I even tried some simple games like Simple Planes and I played Minecraft and League of Legends. And it didn't play that well. But it played, it played good at League. So, that's one good thing. So, if you're playing League and you have this computer, you can play it on it. But yeah. So, do I recommend this computer for gaming? No, not at all. Can you play on it? Yes, if you're not the type of guy that needs high FPS and the best graphics settings, if you just care about the gameplay, you can play on it. But I wouldn't recommend this computer for anyone who wants to play any games. But if you're picking up if for free or a very, very cheap price, uh, go pick it up because it's an actually pretty nice computer. It's pretty quick and uh, has an alright monitor, it has an alright CPU. Anyway guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like this, leave a like on the comment 
section. Oh, a long time since I've done this. Leave a like and drop something in the comment section if you have any questions or something. If you want me to do more like PC tech videos, I'm probably going to do more of them. Please, 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 please write it in the comment section and subscribe for more content. And that's all guys. Thank you guys. I'll see you in the next video.